This is a Volvox GenStation Pro, the top of our domestic range. It can produce 10 kilowatts of electricity and with the full heat recovery that we have on this model can supply 20 kilowatts of heat. Heat is supplied just the same way as a boiler, couldn't be any simpler. Cool water flows in at the bottom pipe, hot water flows out at the top. This engine um, has absolutely no silencer on it at the moment. The exhaust pipe is below the lower water pipe. The uh, silencer will be fitter, fitted on the customer's site. In this case the customer is a school and the uh, heat recovery, heat recovered, will be used for space heating. So this is the top of the range in that <coughs> uh, this one will be synchronized with the grid. There will be a synchronizing controller and a G59 relay. And it will also run on vegetable oil. With a sophisticated engine like the Yanmar, which this is, the conversion to vegetable oil is a two fuel conversion. It starts on diesel, stops on diesel, uh, but runs on waste vegetable oil. There's a 200 litre tank in the base of this uh, enclosure. That will be filled with diesel and will probably never need to be filled again. The vegetable oil fuel tank will be external. So this is a three cylinder TMV Yanmar engine with a Leroy Summer alternator, single phase. A wonderful piece of kit. The heat reco recovery happens at this end. It's a stainless steel three pass exhaust gas heat exchanger. The three pass means that we get uh, lots of surface area in a very small space so we can fit it neatly at the end here. This is a standard controller, deep sea, 702, that will be replaced by a much more sophisticated grid sinking controller. As you can see here, also available in a three phase version. lift-in bar at each end. Exhaust pipe at the bottom. That's a two-inch BSP female connector there. Very easy to install.